Hey guys, what's going on? Scott Burns here. Got another video for you. Happy Thanksgiving! Oh my gosh, you guys, one of the best holiday seasons of the year. Thanksgiving is upon us, and I am so thankful for each and every one of you guys, all the subscribers, the viewers, everybody that's clicking that like button. Just so thankful for you guys. Since it's Thanksgiving, we're gonna be hanging out with family, friends, we're gonna be going to dinners, parties, we're gonna be eating mashed potato, fried chicken, turkey, ham, beers, wine, all that good stuff. So I thought it'd be a fun video uh, to how we can keep our beard and mustache clean through all those meals and drinks. So I thought it'd be a good idea to go over some tips and tricks how to keep your beard and mustache clean through all those dinners, parties, drinks, and sodas, those kinds of things. That way, when we're coming out of the dinner, we don't, uh, we're not wearing our plate on our beards and mustaches, all right? So let's jump ship, dive right into it. This is gonna be how to keep your beard and mustache clean through the holiday season. Here we go. Okay, first thing on the list is gonna be food. There are certain things that we wanna stay away from uh, that are gonna be attacking the beard and mustache, and those are usually gonna be your finger foods. Um, you know, uh, ribs, fried chicken, you know, hamburgers, those kinds of things, uh, chicken nuggets, you know, those kinds of, with dipping sauces, those really affect the beard and mustache because we're, we have to open our mouth, we gotta put it right in our front of our face, and it's usually a big piece of meat, chicken, or even mashed potatoes. We wanna break it down. So the, the uh, fix to this is break down your food with your fork and knife. We want small little bites. That way when we're putting it in our mouth, it's just a little bite. We don't have to, uh, you know, get any collateral damage on our beard and mustache. Number two is gonna be drinks, wine, beer, eggnog, all that good stuff, okay? Anything like that that's got whipped cream or a foam on top. I know wine doesn't really have um, a foam or, you know, a fuzz on top, but at least when you drink it, uh, you know, it can get on the mustache a little bit. So a fix to that is either get like a thermos, something that has like a really small hole that you can uh, drink out of, or a big tip, uh, or my favorite is the straw. You can put the straw in anything, a soda, an eggnog, um, a beer, anything, you know, and that way you're just drinking out a small, uh, a small hole and it's not gonna affect uh, the soul patch, the beard, or the mustache, all right? So let's stay away from the foams. Uh, the whipped creams uh, and those fluff, fluffy drinks that are going to be uh, kind of messing around because when it's time to say goodbye and, and we're going to be leaving the party or we're walking around and we're conversing, we don't want to have little bits and pieces of fried chicken or uh, whipped cream coming out of our beard and mustache. We want to have a nice print and proper uh, beard and mustache with that. Alright guys, and the third and last one is going to be cleaning and maintenance. We always want to keep around like a wet nap uh, or a handkerchief that we can get wet and when we're uh, by a sink or something we can actually pull off the uh, excess remains of food, drinks, or anything else that's in the beard. So that way when we go into the bathroom we can take that handkerchief or wet nap and we can pull off all the sauce or crispies or uh, <laughs> uh, whipped cream out of our beards and mustache, right? Because we really want to keep uh, everything looking good all the way through the party. So that's going to be it for today, you guys. I just wanted to bring a fun video for the holidays, and uh, I just wanted to say thank you so much for all you subscribers, viewers, and everybody that's clicking the like button. I am so thankful for you guys, and I uh, just wish you guys have a great holiday season. Like always, you guys, like, subscribe, and favorite, and I will see you guys on the flip side. See ya!